All right, Shalom. <clears throat> We'd like to start off this lesson by saying Barakat Yahweh, Bahasham Yahushai, Barakat Hakodash, giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahasham Yahushai, Bahasham Rakat Kadash. Yahweh is the true, holy, powerful, and mighty name of the only uh, Salakia, of the Heavenly Father. Bahashem, meaning in the name, Yahweh Shai being the uh, true, holy, and powerful name of, of His only begotten Son, our Lord and our Savior, uh, the Savior of the nation of Israel. Israel consisting of you so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, uh, Indians, as well as you other uh, brothers that may be scattered abroad that look unto uh, the nations where, you, where you've been scattered to. Okay, Rakah HaKwadash is the Holy Spirit, the only way you can worship the Father and the Son, which is through the Son. And we want to give double honors to the elders and the apostles of Great Millstone out in New York that do rule well. Peace, blessings, mercy, and salutations to all the brothers enduring afflictions, presenting their bodies as a living sacrifice, doing this, uh, uh, do, uh, do, doing this work, man, in the uh, utmost charity and sincerity. Okay? Um, you know, I, I'm the brother Mala Akia here with the brother uh, Yahweh Hanan from the Great Millstone camp, the branch out in Des Moines, uh, Des Moines, Iowa. And, you know, uh, we're just on our lunch break right now. And, damn, you know what? Uh, I didn't put the timer on for what time. So, uh, the spirit. The spirit. Um, you know, and, and we were just kind of talking about uh, something that, that had came up uh, this weekend at class uh, about how, or I believe it was at camp, about how the works that we're doing, man, are, are, are mighty works, you know, and that through, really you got to see it. You have to have faith, man. You have to have faith to be in this thing, but really to, to be able to see and to acknowledge and cherish what we're really doing, man. You know, not just living uh, uh um how do you say it L living through the motions so to speak but really uh valuing and embracing e each and every moment of this truth man whether it be the persecution that we go through whether it be uh, other people that we uh that the spirit uh uh may use us to, to 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 speak to them to give them the word and see them get inspired and see them see that that that, that kind of uh, uh that that's that that uh what, what do you call it the that hope light up in their eyes man you know what whatever the case may be man is embracing every single part of this truth man of this ministry you know because i mean you don't know who might be listening you know maybe a brother having a you know a bad week you know what i'm saying and, and your lesson you know might spark a lesson in them and make them feel better man you know i mean it's all about it's all about you know for uh, um you know edifying the body man you know, because you don't know who, who needs to hear that message, you know, that, that you, you want to say in your lessons, man. You know, it's a beautiful thing that what we've called in, man. It's a beautiful, it's a, it's a, it's a yapa thing, man. Like, you know, like the brother and I were talking that, you know what I'm saying? Like the, the Lord had mercy on us to give us this, uh, this light, man. You know? Come, you know, and, uh, you know, th through the spirit, we're going to title this lesson. Um, we've been granted access, you know, something along the lines of that, you know, um, because, hey, hey, as it is written, many are called into this and few are chosen, man. So, hey, hey we've been called. Now it's time to, uh, uh, um, let's get that real quick. Uh, present, um, give that diligence. To make a call. I think mm -hmm. it's uh, First Peter 3 and 10. This is Second Peter Second. 1 and 10. It says, Wherefore, rather, brethren, give diligence to make your calling and election sure. For if you do these things, you shall never fail. Okay. Right? So we've been called into this ministry, man. We've been called, but, you know, we don't know if we're chosen. We believe through faith that we are a part of that elect, you know, uh, 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 through, through prophecy and through the, the, the spirit, through the Lord supping with us, revealing certain things unto us, man. We believe that firmly, you know, and that's the faith that we got to have. But hey, we've been granted access unto this truth, man, because it is not given unto all, man. You know, and Isaiah, it, it speaks about how uh, uh, people's eyes uh, were made fat that they cannot see, you know, their ears uh, that they may not hear. You know where that's at? I got that actually right here. It says, um, Isaiah 29 and 10, For the Lord Yahweh has poured out upon you the uh, spirit of deep sleep and has closed your eyes. The prophets and rulers and the seers have covered. It says, All the vision of all is become... Uh, I think that's the point right here. On the, it says the Lord has uh, put him a, a spirit of sleep. I don't know if that's what you wanted. No, there's another one. Um... But uh, you know the Lord, like like it says here, man. You know, not like I said, it goes back to the uh, uh, um, you know um, Isaiah six and ten. It's a lot. It's all good. It's all good. Um, but it just goes back to you know none. Um, lots are called and few are chosen. You know. <laughs> It says Isaiah 6 and 10, make thy heart for this people fat and make 
You could start at nine. You want me to start at nine? It says uh, Isaiah six and nine, and he said, "Go and tell this people, hear ye indeed, but understand not, and see ye indeed, but perceive not." Right, man. So it doesn't matter how how well you can break something down, how many times you could tell somebody, how many times they 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 hear the word, man. If they're not if they're not chosen to receive it, man, then they're not chosen to receive it. You know. Um. Come on, keep keep your Bible. Question. Okay. It says Isaiah 6 and 10, make the heart of this people fat and make their ears heavy and shut their eyes, lest they see with their eyes and hear with their ears and understand with their hearts and convert and be healed. Man. Right. So there's there's people that are that aren't meant to get this, man. There's people that the Lord just ain't fucking with point blank, period, man. You know, but hey, the what are y'all by that we've what been able to, to receive, been able to understand, man, that, that we we have that unction, you know. And that, that, that's the faith that we have, that, that through us understanding this word, through us receiving this ministry that is a mighty ass work, hey, that, that, that we, are, we are part of that elect, you know, Yahweh Ratzazah, you know, because we're, we're not 100% sure, but that's the faith we have. That's the utmost faith that we got, man. You know, hey, who, who else can it be, man? The, 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 uh, it's, it's, the Lord said that he would leave us uh, pastors that, that, that should feed us, you know, with the... Uh, uh, um, I got that real quick. Con, I don't want to butcher it. It says Isaiah, uh, Jeremiah, Salakia. It says Jeremiah <coughs> uh, 3 and 15. And I will give you pastors according to my heart, which shall feed you with knowledge and understanding. Con, you know, hey, and, and all that's written, man. And, and, and through process of elimination, hey, that has to be the elders and the apostles of Great Millstone. You know, Apostle Tahar on down, man. There's people that are set up, man, set up over us. You know, it, it says that they should not hold their peace the, uh, day nor night. Hey, man, who, who has that been? Who, who's who been out there laboring? You know, who's the truth been given unto? Who? Hey, it, it said that the Lord will give us a, a mouth that, that no man may gain, say, no, uh, uh, no resist. Hey, that, that, there, there's nothing that, that, that can come against this truth, man. And we we gotta believe that this is that this is the hundred percent truth. It says let every uh we got we gotta be fully persuaded in our own mind, man. Because yeah, because it says too that the Lord didn't leave he he set up shepherds and not leave us lacking. And it says Jeremiah twenty three and four. And I will set up shepherd, shepherds over you, uh them which shall feed them, and they shall fear no more, nor be dismayed. Neither shall they be lacking, said the Lord Yahweh. So these men's been pushing, <coughs> you know what I'm saying. For a long time, over 30 years, man, you know, not leaving us lacking like these other camps. But uh, go ahead, Salakia. Okay, this one. is uh, Luke chapter 10 and verse 20. <clears throat> it says, Notwithstanding in this, rejoice not that the spirits are subject into you, but rather rejoice because your names are written in heaven. And that's the faith we gotta. That's the faith that we gotta have that our names are written in heaven, man. It says, In that hour, Yahweh Shai rejoiced in spirit and said, I thank thee, O Father, Lord of heaven and earth. That thou hast hid these things from the wise and the prudent, and has revealed them unto babes. Even so, Father, for so it seemed good in thy sight. It says, uh, you know, that's the point, that these things were, were revealed unto the babes, man. That it wasn't given unto the prudent, unto the wise, you know. Amen. That, 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 that this ministry was, was given unto men that were esteemed as nothing, man. And that's us through the Spirit, man. Because, hey, who the hell are we? You know, who, who uh, you know, who, uh, who the hell are we? You know, I got you that uh, first in, uh, Corinthians, if you want me to. Okay. It says first Corinthians one in uh, 26, right? Because he said this was this was given on to to uh, to um to babes, man. You know, it says for uh, first Corinthians one and 26. For ye see your calling, brethren, how that not many wise men after the flesh, not many mighty. Uh, and not many noble are called, but the Most High has chosen the foolish things of this world to confound the wise. And the Most High has chosen the weak things of the earth, world to confound the things that are mighty, man. It says, and the base things of this world and things which are despised has the Lord Yahweh chosen. Yeah, and the things which are not to bring to not things that are our man, you know. So he chose the the uh, the insignificant people of this world, like uh, uh, let's so-called Native Americans, Hispanics, and Blacks, men, the elect within that, right you know, now. the true Israel, because uh, uh, you know they uh, we we were once in our sin, man. We were doing drugs, you know what I'm saying, and, and doing whatever uh, you know brothers did before in the world, man. But the Lord called us what into repentance, and because He has mercy on us, man, you know. 
Because uh, people are looking at us now, they're like, oh, so, you know what I'm saying? So you've changed now, you know? Like back then you were doing this and that, but guess what? The Lord had mercy, you know, and, and given us this, this wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, man. Right, we were esteemed as nothing. You know, we, we weren't some uh, uh, some some people that went to a, uh, uh, what's it called? Seminary school. Seminary school, you know, like the brother said. You know, we, 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 we you know, a lot of us might have grown up in a, a maybe a, cat, a Christian church or a Catholic church or, or not, not, not even close, you know, maybe just believing in the Lord. You know, not really knowing anything, man. You know, whether, whether we were in the ghettos, we, whether we were in the streets where we were slinging, whether we were uh, in gangs, wh whatever the case may have been, man. You know, well, esteem does nothing in this place. You know, we, we, we weren't holding, uh, we're, we're not business, high-end business owners, <laughs> you know, uh, dr driving around uh, the nicest luxury cars. Hey, man, you know, a lot of us were suffering in this world. But it says what? That the Lord has given us unto this. And and with what I brought out in that first Corinthians, hey, that's 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 uh um that's faith boosting within itself because it says that it was revealed unto babes. And who was he talking to? He was talking to uh uh, uh he was talking to them that said what that said what it said the rejoice uh because your names are written in heaven. So the Lord told these men, hey, your names are written in heaven, and he rejoiced that it was given unto the babes. So if that's us, man, that means that our names are written in heaven, you know. It, they it, they have to be. That's that's the faith. That's that's faith within as hell because the Lord is you. That's that shows the power of the Lord because He's using people that didn't have, don't have that. You know, spend billions of dollars in colleges and things like that. You know, like King David. You know, the Lord. He was a young man, King David. You know, he was a really young man to to kill this big ass Goliath, man. This big ass Hamite. You know. <laughs> so that sh that shows the the the. The Lord's power, man. You know, and he and he's doing it now, man. He's raising up people that are significant to this world that are so-called drug dealers. They call us drug dealers. They call us uh, 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 um, what, what was it? whatever they want to call us, man. You know, we didn't go to college, you know, but the Lord is showing his power within that, man. You know, it's Isaiah 28 and verse nine. It says, whom shall he teach knowledge and whom shall he make to understand doctrine? Them that are weaned from the milk and drawn from the breast. It says, for precept must be upon precept, precept upon precept, line upon line, line upon line, here a little and there a little. For with stammering lips and another tongue <laughs> will he speak unto his people. Okay? So, hey, man, it, 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 this truth is to give unto them who are weaned from the milk and drawn from the breast. Hey, Yahweh Shai said that, that you got to become a, 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 you got to be born again, man. You know? And, and when you're born again, hey, you got to become as a babe, man. You, 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 everything that you thought you might have known in the world that you thought you might have known ba uh, about the scriptures, man, hey, you got to toss that all to the side and, and learn through the spirit and power of Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai, you know? If, if that's what's given unto you, and you got to grow from that milk, you know? Just like he he gave it unto babes, all right, well, just as a babe, just like a baby needs to suck, suck uh, 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 his mom's titty and, and, and get that milk to, to get the nutrients, to, to get the... Uh, um, Apostle Gabar was bringing out, you know, the colostrum, all, all, all those vitamins, those minerals that the baby needs, man. It's the same thing with these scriptures, man. It's the same thing with this truth, with this knowledge. You know, you 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 got to get the milk first and, and be built up in this. You know, cause hey, hey and and that within itself, it's called the milk. But really, to these to these people on the outside, hey man, that, that it's a stumbling block unto them. You know, a lot of people can't understand. Uh, 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 that that the names Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai that it's not Jesus and it's not God like that's that's a whole stumbling block unto them man they can't understand that that you know that uh uh, uh that he was a so called uh, uh black man they can't understand that the Israelites were dark skinned you know they can't understand that the law is not done away with like th those are stumbling blocks unto these people you know but but hey through, through, through the spirit and power Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai through mercy through grace it has been given unto us. I got that real quick just to back you up. It says Ecclesiasticus um, 39 and 24. And his ways are plain unto the holy, so are they stumbling blocks unto the wicked. You know? So I was just backing up the brother, man, real quick. 
But I got that Second Peter's for you. Uh, Second Peter's. Uh, first oh, Peter's. I got uh, First Peter's two and uh, two. As newborn babes, desire the sincere milk of the word that ye may grow by, man. You know, we were speaking with the brother about that. That you know, with knowing the milk, the the you know, the color of the Lord, who the Gentiles are. You know, uh, 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 knowing the names of Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh Shai. You know, uh, you know who is salvation for things like that. You know, you learning the scriptures like that puts you in a different level, man. You know, because then you can you can uh, you know you can put those milk scriptures together to fit you know to figure out what that's talking about man yeah, you can reason with you know this. exactly like you know not everything got to be a question why because you can read into the spirit man because why you have that milk man you know that that rock that found that stirred foundation you know that it talks about in matthew man you know right and it's and it's not just breakdowns right you know it's, it's how to be a good brother it's yeah. how to react in certain things i have not uh, uh not to make haste in time of trouble you know all these things that that, that, that we got to learn man from, from the get-go you know a a sirach the uh, so, so rock the second chapter the, I believe that Needs to be like milk Like hey yeah. like if, My son If thou come to serve the Lord Prepare thy soul for temptation That should be the first thing One of the very first things That, that you learn man Like hey You're gonna enter into this Just know Hey Hell is coming your way bro You know Gird yourself up uh, This is Second Corinthians Chapter 5 And verse uh, I'll start at 17 It says Therefore if any man be In Hamashayach He is a new creature Old things are passed away. Behold, all things are become new. And all things are of the Most High, who hath reconciled us to himself by Yahweh Shai Hamashayach, and hath given to us the ministry of reconciliation. And when you go into that word reconciliation, it means to make friendly again. Okay? It says to wit, to, to, to make what? Hey, hey, the, the people of the Most High, the Israelites, friends, uh, join back unto the Lord, man. It says to wit that the Most High was in Yahweh Shai, Reconciling the world unto himself, not imputing their trespasses unto them, and have committed unto us the word of reconciliation. Right? He he committed that word unto us, man. Meaning that that we have the word of reconciliation. It says, "Let let thy light shine." You know, a a a. We got to do these things that that Yahweh Bashami Yahushai may be glorified, man. You know that the people that people turn back. It's not for our glory. It's for the glory of the Lord, man. You know, and that's a beautiful yeah. thing in itself, man. So lock it. That's a beautiful thing in itself, man. You know, the Lord's given us power with his word, man, to call sinner into repentance, man, which is our people, you know, Israel. And then to bring down this wicked ass kingdom, man. It says uh, verse 20. Now, then we are ambassadors for Yahweh Shai, as though the most high did beseech you by us. We pray you in Yahweh Shai's stead. Be ye reconciled unto the Most High, and and that's what we're out there doing, man. Uh, uh to telling telling these people do not th this abominable oh, thing which the I Lord hate. hates, man. To telling them repent or perish, telling them the things that are coming, repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand, man. The same things that that that, uh, that Yahweh Shai uh, was teaching, hey, man. He he gave unto us to teach, man, to make friendly unto him again, man. You know. And like the brother said, man, hey, through the spirit and power, y'all, by Shem, y'all, Shai, that's what we're doing in the spirit, man. You know, we're, 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 we're uh, uh, fr freeing the captives. You know, we're, we're burying the dead. We're healing the sick. We're, 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 we're giving sight to the blind through the spirit right now, which is going to be a, and, and, and physically Literally. we're going to do that as well, man. But in the spirit, that's what we're doing right now, man. You know, because Jake out there is through. And it's a mighty, it's a mighty ass fucking thing that we're doing, bro. It's mighty as fuck. Like you got, you got, you got to understand that, man. Think of your life, how your life turned around, man. You got the power through Yahweh Ba'asham Yahweh Shai to speak those words, to be able to tell somebody who they are. <laughs> you know, and to speak directly to Yahweh Ba'asham Yahweh Shai, man. Because what I said, the uh, the the pray. Uh, the the, exactly the uh, basically rough paraphrase says the uh, when when a righteous man is praying it pierces the clouds so it goes straight to heaven you got to believe that man we got power to do that <clears throat> people that don't believe in how why y'all were shy man they don't have the opportunity like we do man hey well it says we got power we got uh, uh, the the spirits are subject unto us exactly man you know you know so man it's it's a mighty deal man it, it's it's beautiful you know. I had to sit down and meditate on that, man, because sometimes, you know, Jake be weak and sometimes, you know what I'm saying, that the flesh be getting it to us. But we got to understand that we're serving the yeah, the power uh, that created, man, the heaven and earth. Okay. Yahweh Ba Hashem Yahweh Shai, man. And that's just a mighty work in itself, man.
And we're gonna smack these last few because uh, I'm pretty sure we we're probably con, late. Con. <laughs> but uh, Romans 10 and 13 it says, "For whosoever shall call upon the name of Yahweh Basham Yahushai shall be saved." Right? But it says, "How then shall they call on him in whom they have not believed? And how shall they believe in him of whom they had not heard? And how shall they hear without a preacher?" Hey, Yahweh Shai himself said, <clears throat> "If I would have not come, then that." Uh, <clears throat> then there would there would be no uh, um, there would be cloak for their sins. Kind that there would be cloak for their sins, but since I have came, there is no cloak for their sins. You know, <clears throat> it says you know roughly paraphrasing. Yeah, yeah. It says, and how shall they preach except they be sent? As it is written, how beautiful are the feet of them that that preach the gospel of peace and bring glad tidings of good things. Right? It says, beautiful are the feet of them that preach the gospel of peace. Man, our past. You know. And, and, and that's what we're doing is preaching peace, man. Re, uh, uh, making friendly uh, uh, our people again until Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai, which is going to bring true peace to this earth, man. Con, you got that, Isaiah? So Isaiah 61 and 1. And the Spirit of the Lord Yahweh, the power, is upon me because the Lord Yahweh has anointed me to preach good tidings unto the meek. He has sent me to the bind up the brokenhearted, to proclaim liberty to the captives, mm -hmm. and the opening of the prison to them that are bound. There you go, man, to proclaim liberty to the captives. Hey, it says uh, in the book of John, uh, I believe it's John 8 and 33 or 36, it says that who, who to whom the Lord sets free uh, shall be free indeed, man, you know? Be, uh, uh, so so what? Hey, and how do you be set free? But hey, by, by this word, man. This word is what sets you free. This word is is what breaks those those mental chains, man. You know, to know who you are. To, exactly, to know who you are. To know who we serve. To know our purpose. You know, because because everybody's walking around without a without a damn purpose in life, man. And then we understand that what? Hey, hey, fear the Most High and keep His and keep His commandments. For it is the whole duty of man, man. You know, that's all we got to do. That that that's our job. To go out, to preach, to do to do this, man. It, it says that we have been anointed to preach good tidings unto the meek, man. And, and, and we are the meek. And we got to believe that. Like it says in Jeremiah, it says before we were we were born, uh, when we were in the womb, that the Lord anointed us, that he ordained us a prophet unto the nations. In the first That's chapter it. in Sirach, it says uh, that the, uh, he was born, uh, uh, the faithful was born from the uh, womb. Um, was was made in the womb, roughly paraphrasing in the first uh, chapter of Ecclesiasticus, man. It says, "With faithful in the womb, womb man." Faithful in the womb. Con, man. He, the spirit's cold, man. The Lord's cold as hell. You know. This is Daniel twelve and two, and many of them that sleep in the dust of the earth shall awake. Right, that confusion, man. That not knowing who you are. You know, it says, "He that wandereth out of the way uh, of understanding remaineth in the congregation of the dead." It says, "Some to everlasting life, and some to shame and everlasting contempt." And they that be wise shall shine as the firmament, as the brightness of the firmament. And they that churn many to righteousness hmm. as the stars forever and ever. You Damn. know? So hey, hey, that, that, that's mighty as hell, man. And that's what we're doing right now. That's that's what we're doing through the spirit and power of Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai. You know, praying Lord's will that we endure. Okay? I got the last one for you. It says 2 uh, Corinthians 4 and uh, 1. Therefore, <laughs> seeing we have this ministry... As we have received mercy, we faint not, man. Hey, there, there you go. You know, just us simply receiving this word, that's mercy within itself. Being able to call upon the name of the Lord, understanding who the uh, who, who who's the power that we serve, why we're here. Hey, being able to, 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 to go out and do these brotherly things. Because when we're going out there, we're doing it out of uh, charity, man. We're doing it for, for, for these, uh, for uh, out of love. You know, it, it, it says uh, the, the Lord is not uh, unrighteous to forget your labor of love. Hey man, that, that's the labor of love that we're doing, man. Showing brotherly love towards one another. Hey, hey, healing, healing each other. You know, praying for each other. Go, going out, share, uh, uh, proclaiming this gospel. And just within that, that that's a, that's a, a like I said, it's um, it's mercy within itself, man. It, it truly, it really, truly is, man. If you don't want salvation, I don't know what the hell you want, man. Hey, it, it tells you that uh, uh um, it, because really, you got to put it in perspective, man. We ain't worthy of shit. You know, know, we really aren't. It tells us that that, that that our righteousness is as filthy rags. Man, you, you, you read about our, our history and how dirty we did the Lord, man. Uh, how many times he reached out his hand unto us. He cleaned, he cleaned us up. He decked us out, you know, <laughs> and, and we still wanted to go play the harlot, as it says in Ezekiel. Hey, man, we don't deserve shit. Hey, man, it tells you we just read in the book of Job. It says that that, that the uh, basically that the angels are unclean in the sight of the Lord. How much more us that live in, in, in uh, I believe it says uh, uh, vessels, 
um, made a clay, made a clay, you know, something along the lines of that. Hey, Amen. But 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 through mercy, we have received this word, man. <laughs> so hey, we faint not. Beautiful man. You know, so hey, Lord willing, that was a that was a you know exhorting or comforting or edifying. Okay. You know, we give all praises. To Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Rakakwadash, double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone that rule well. Peace, blessings, salutations to all the brothers out there. Till the next time, we say Shalom. Shalom, Akiyam. <clears throat>